It literally is so underfed. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Die. All right, lads, we are back with Krakow. For those of you joining me for the first time, let me show you around. We started out as a one province miner, and we went on from there to become the Holy Roman Emperor. Uh, it looks like Bohemius Bob for himself. We'll stamp that out pretty soon. Uh, and we're starting to go down the reforms. Uh, we just started expanding the empire and getting more guys in. I think we're going to continue that uh, today. If you recall, we have Burgundy under Postal Union. We're allied to Castile and Muscovy. And I'm pretty sure it was France we wanted to attack next, wasn't it? I don't know why there's two Imperial bands. There's one which is like, take Verdun. And then the other one is like, take <laughs> Capital Paris. Right, it's currently in peace internally. Let's see. Who else borders the Holy Roman Empire that I can get in? Moldavia, potentially? So I can get the Livonian Order. Galicia, Valinia, Mantua, and Lucca. Our manpower's good. Our money's good. All these oceans are a bit high, but that's fine. When can we fight the Lithuanians again? Now. Although I don't really want to expand. I can't, I can't just want to improve my uh, my empire. We are about to get Gemina Pfenning. Also, the Reformation still hasn't fired, so that's, that's good. Because we need to stomp that out the second it turns up. It's actually a good way of fighting the Teutons. So I'm pretty sure the Teutons are allied to no one. They are part of the empire, so, so. <laughs> there's that. Honestly, I just think taking them is probably a good idea anyway. Capital Paris. Bring everyone in. Let's go in against the French. All right. We're actually going to need all of our troops on this one. Because I don't trust the AI won't mess it up. But our troops really are not good. <laughs> I don't really want to get into any battles. See, that's why you don't want to get into... I don't... Woods, let's just give a shot. Two to one. Show us how much of a coward I am right now. Okay, we're on par militarily. We call Trier in. Okay, lads. Victory is assured. I almost dissolved the alliance. I did not want to do that. Call to arms. Are you still not voting for me? Bohemia, man. Come on, make it unanimous. Let's call ourselves some morale. <laughs> Jesus Christ, the French troops. All right, let's go straight for his capital. Blow it up. I don't want to overstat, because again, manpower. Castile, you coming in, chief? Castile, where are your men? <laughs> I see you have 3,000, but where are the rest of them? Dude, Castile, where are your men? <laughs> like, legitimately. Oh, no, he has more troops than I do. Dude, where are the Russians? Okay, they're taking out Genoa. Can I just white piece Genoa? I don't want to be here with him. This is bad. I don't see any Castilian troops. I was kind of relying on them. Okay, if I win this siege before anything else, I should be okay. I just need to hope that I get Miltech Nile before he does. This was very poorly organized. Okay, so I have all of these allies, but no one showed up. It's just me and the Palatinate, I suppose. Oh, God, and rebels. Uh, I am going to embrace colonialism because it brings me that little bit closer. Okay, I've got Paris. I did not want to be fighting this. Uh, so there are no Spanish troops at all. Okay, let's take out these troops. I'm hoping that if I can get Genoa out, the rest of these guys will just turn up. Well, okay, I'm... I'm... All right, Castile. Castile has 51,000 troops. That's more than me and everyone else. But where? Are you off in the new world? It literally is so underfed. <laughs> Why? Okay, what if I set, like, yo, Castile, take this. And um, we lost the Siege of Paris. Right, let's try and take it back. Where are the... Where are they now? They're just standing still. Oh, this was a horrible, horrible mistake. This was a horrible mistake. <laughs> no one turned up. And get the next tech. That's good. I don't want to reset my soldiers' morale just yet. Oh my god, Bohemia would come in. That's that's big. Another 10,000 troops. Okay, Castile's just going to get rolled because they've got nothing to defend them. <laughs> okay, if all of his troops are down there, I'm going to take the risk and switch over to Pike and retreat, which is going to make his troops start to flood upwards to come fight me. If I can win the siege, I can retreat. Good. Hey, bud. Okay, you left, didn't you? Oh, no. He's going to stack wipe that, isn't he? Lads. Lads, pile in. Pile in. Pile in. Pile in. There we go. My God. We should have free reign of his country pretty much now, though. Okay, Age of Discovery is happening. So he's going to stomp that out. Oh, my God. I don't know what to do. Castile's going to lose so much war score. Let's keep clearing up these little stacks. How much manpower? How much manpower does he have? 26,000. Okay, if the boys come in with me, we should be fine. The boys... Le you left. Oh, a horrible mistake. Muscovy only goes in after we've, like, lost. Okay, if I go stand on the edge, will he, will he come out? Stop dying! Oh my god, look at Castile. They don't have a single unit. Alright, I'm gonna try and get Savoy out this wall by cheesing it a little bit. Castile White Peace, that's actually really good for us, considering they did nothing either way. Okay, and I might be able to get you out now. Yes. You won't do it? Well, I mean, I'll just get you out. Okay. The tide may not be turning, per se, but it's definitely more promising. Liège will just come out. Okay, we should be fine now. Oh my god, we got triple as men, surely. Oh, you want a royal marriage? Yeah, sure, buddy, let's have a royal marriage. You and me, old pal. 50,000 troops, not a single one is defending Iberia. God damn, if I knew that, I'd march in. I'm tempted to go in and conquer them. I know there's a lot of rebels in my country, but I have to stay here because, you know, separating means that. Let's stack wiped. Stop. 
Please, just stay near one another. I'm telling you now, the AI, when it's on your team, it's it's just an idiot. The AI on the opposing team, the hugest of brains. Oh, that's a 64%, not now. I need to trap those guys in. All right, another idea group. I'm gonna go influence, fits the theme. Okay, oh, England's gone Protestant. Those are horrible nations that... Okay, so how it works when you want to stamp out the Protestant Reformation is you want lots of like, you know, three little nations and you go in and just destroy them by forcing religion. These guys are a lot trickier than that because they are Denmark, England, and this one's fine. But those are nations that I can't handle. Oh my God, he's gonna go off the remind me. He's gonna hold. Don't know where the separatists went. <laughs> Uh, get a thousand men. Just go and deal with those. They're on 49% already. Who was that? Bohemia? That's fine. Provided it's not Muscovy, who uh, look like they're going to come out pretty soon. <laughs> Second time I've got that event in like a year. Actually having to slacken. <laughs> it's Tria done. Okay, so what are the main detractors? Dijon is five. I think I'm going to just spread out. Uh, maximize the war score. Get out of this war before the Muscovites change their mind and decide that they don't want to be here anymore. Another 10% because I've got Scotland out. I don't know where the French troops are. I'm just going to focus on grinding out the war score. Saxony's gone. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we're going to be releasing a lot of stuff, boys. Going to say hello to a lot of different nations. I mean, I wish they'd join the empire, but they won't because they don't border it. These guys up here would. Uh, actually, they technically do because hung because of uh, Burgundy. No, Burgundy don't, aren't in the empire. That sucks. I feel like they should count as in the empire. Considering they have like land here, they should count as it. Uh oh, by Burgundy. It's also about bleeding the French because once they dominate the French, we should be okay. So they, they were sort of the last major, well, apart from the Ottomans, who uh, I'm not going to touch. There we go. That should be it. Give it done to Burgundy. And then, can I can release Gascony? That's a huge chunk of land, but it's probably just going to get swallowed up by the English. So I don't really want to do that. Provence is a good one. Toulouse could be fun. Provence is a good one. Olenne, Toulouse, not Toulouse. Those are all guys that are good. Wait, what? Did you throw more? <laughs> do they always have that? Oh, hello, dog. She's realized now that uh, me, when I'm recording, gives her attention if she jumps up. So this is Millie. So she can just chill. All right, decide now, please, dog. Are you going to stay or are you going to go? Oh, you, you want to speak to the people? <laughs> All right. Imperial ban against who? What do I have Imperial ban? On you, Burgundy. Elusive linear. Why do I have Imperial ban on you? Wait, did one of my provinces flip? It did. Huh. I should have been keeping an eye on that. Well, that's annoying. Independence guaranteed by Krakow. I don't want to... <sighs> no. Okay, well, let's get out of this war. Um, I said love war operations. Well, I don't think it's going to happen. Could release Normandy. Oh, I like that. Toulouse Dauphiné. That's, yeah, just basically the south. I like that. Uh, we'll, we'll do that. Okay, we lost like 300,000 troops. Burgundy has unlawful territory. I can just demand it off him. <laughs> so unnecessary, but sure. Uh, let's go around and avoid this stuff so we can get back into our own land. Well, that sucked. Uh, we'll go up against England, sure. And we need more reform. People are voting against it. Average is minus two. Diplomatic opinion, reputation, opinion of the emperor, political authority. Current amount of reforms. Hmm. I get my my reputation up. Well, it's already up as much as it. Well, we have just inherited Burgundy. Pretty sure it means that these uh these lads can join the empire now. Go on, join it. Join the empire. And Dutch revolt. I can get rid of that soon. Okay, let's rival the French. I'm not gonna rival the Bohemians. Pretty sure if I just accept Dutch, right? There are no Dutch provinces. <laughs> right, so what do I need to accept? Three. Uh, so Dutch and Flemish. That's Flemish. Let's find culture. Those are Dutch provinces. We don't have any Dutch provinces. <laughs> This isn't good. All following must be true. Dutch is not an accepted culture, but I can't accept it because I don't have any Dutch provinces. <laughs> oh, I do. I do. I do. Breda. Okay, right. There you go. Over here. Dutch, 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 Dutch. Bang. There we go. No more No more disaster. Okay. Now I need to improve relations with you. Draw ourselves some siege ability. Okay, I just need to grow my imperial authority just a little bit. It's 33. I have the slot. I'm going to royal marry Denmark in the hopes that I can grab that, his heir, basically. And then I'll claim his throne. And then I'll stamp out Protestantism from there. Why did who? Why am I guaranteeing you? I mean, you'll become my vassal. I feel like a lot of people will. Then I can change your religion from there. Oh, it's not Baden. It's this one, Württemberg. I think a lot of people would become my vassal. Ah, I can do the reform. Wonderful. Gives me yearly tax income. The next one is where we start going real nice. Uh, so that we get increased imperial authority. What the hell is this? Heretic princes. Okay, I'm gonna start slamming down on them. I kind of want to keep influence, but going religious would help convert the centers. So we're gonna do that. All right, we've got princes wise. Just need a reason to declare war on any of you. Mm, I'm not allies need to take out either. Now, this could be huge brain. I take out, like, I vassalize Baden. Baden. And then they probably have a claim, right? They do. And then I use that. We'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. There's no downside, really. Well, there is a downside. It could be really stupid. The alternative is attack Austria. Which now I say that, it's probably a better alternative. Attack Austria into here and then take these two provinces for myself. Come on, buddy, join the empire. Oh, no, you can't because Anjou's over here. Yeah, you can't just go around eating people like that. In fact, yeah, okay, I definitely want you to return that because he's Catholic. 
All right, 30, you're fighting brigands. I don't like that. Do me a favor, Chief. Uh, break your alliance with Wittenberg. You wouldn't. Oh, cast a spell eye. Do I need to cast a spell eye? All right, Age of Reformation time, boys. In this era, we have to somehow stop the Reformation, kill England, and kill Denmark. We need to take the province of Norfolk, of Finn, and Stuttgart. We'll go after Stuttgart first. Okay, we have a claim on Austria. Call in everyone with a pulse. We march. Should probably get a general. I don't have any. Whew. We have a hell of a one now. All right, we also need to go after Ulm, who are a free city. It's annoying, but they're allied to Ingolstadt that we can also take out. We get a claim on them. Who else? Just somehow get up here. Why could we declare war in Denmark? Uh, Lithuania. We fight Lithuania, and that'll bring in Denmark. Okay. It's always nice getting the little guys involved, and they just do absolutely nothing. All right, we'll finish off diplomatic actions, which should allow us to then break our royal ties. It only costs us 10 prestige. And now we'll grab military technology 10. I'm also going to build some forts. Because <laughs> people just sort of march into my land constantly. Okay, we can get peace. We take these two territories. We release Regens. We release Tyrol. Excellent. Now we're going against Wurttemberg. Okay. I'm going to get Castile to break your alliance with England. You'd say no. Trust towards England. Castile is a great power. Well, to be fair, fighting Castile. Really oh, now you have troops here. Really? I don't have any reason to declare war on you. I'm not allied to anyone important. Okay, I'm going to have to call Castile in against Lithuania or something and then fight them. No. Answer wants help. Well, I just need everyone to vote so then I get free Imperial authority. Mines, why are you voting for, uh, for Bohemia, man? Come on. You're better than that. Have that claim. All right. Wait for the month tick. Now will you break your alliance? Oh, God, that's an unfortunate name, isn't it? Okay, well, we're just going to go in after him. I'm back, my troops. Yep. And I was right to. Join the Empire. Do it. We have high relations. There's no reason for you not to. All right. So, Nuremberg. I like how they, they unconditionally surrender after I take everything. They're like, yes, now we will give up. The battle is won. So, we're already here, man. Right, how hard is it going to be to convert you? After a zeal, minus five. Get another couple. Yeah, okay. We should be fine. Ah, oh, for Dortmund. Who are you allied to? No one I can feasibly get to. Well, I can go after Cleves. I feel bad. I'm just like burning through fellow Catholics just to get to uh, the one Protestant Donnies. Okay, well, let's go after the Danish one next, which means fighting Lithuania. And also probably building a navy. Make enough money anyway. Of course, isn't it? 112,000. Let's go after Ingolstadt. Why? I think there was a reason. Okay, allied to Hungary. Allied to Brandenburg, who hopefully won't turn. But they might. Might be more efficient for me to actually just start trying to grow the empire instead of trying to stamp what's already here. Oh god, there's another one. Ooh, this can get rid of all my major allies. It's unfortunate, but necessary. Let's go. So you've turned Anglican. Get rid of this then. Lamb of Leith. <laughs> it's me, but spelled wrong. I already fancy taking on 21 galleys, man, I'm gonna be honest. If I stand here will that threaten will he leave? No, he knows. He knows the power of his galleys. Just want Finn. All right. Uh, Ingolstadt, Ansbach. Got that now. Transferring trade league. Oh, that's okay. He's going to be horrible to fight. Look at this. Oh, okay. Right. Uh, the Swiss one's almost done. And then the rest of you prevent a coalition. Well, David, I really don't want to hurt you, bud. I think you're kind of cool. Right. Who can we pop in here? Let's have a look. Ah, oh, these are all bad ones. Don't care for these ones. Not bad, but they're just, you know, they're not as exciting as the other ones. Um, probably the advisor cost. Right, we'll finish off our ideas. So we get 5% discipline. Always nice. It's this one I need. Hey, a 663. Granted the Castle Valley to make them a junior partner in our union. I could go in and just take Muscovy for myself. We'll see where the uh, cards lie after this war. Okay, we've got 125 in charge. I'm pretty sure I need to just stay at plus two stability. Must have more prestige than they do. They've got 95 prestige. I have to change the Protestant, but I'm ready for that. I need an Inquisitor. Said I need an Inquisitor. Tempted to send in the nine heavies and see what they can do. Is he hiding? It looks like he's hiding. Okay, good. Because I was not confident. I think we're going to bow out of that one. Yeah, we need a few more troops. Oh, I think they both got airs. Yeah, he did. Damn it! That was my chance. Ah, this is an issue. Catholic zealots stand in my way. That's a, an interesting fight to take. Late. It's worked nicely, though. Excellent. Wait, what? Okay. 
Give it back. Because I know you're Protestant, but he's about to be good little Catholic. Tantrums don't really join the Empire anymore, which is a shame. Oh, Davian might have. And Denmark's now got three heavies there. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Buddy, Denmark, just, just give me the land. You know what? You can go free, man. I don't really have an issue with you. What about now? Really? Negative three. All right, I'll give you the land. Brilliant. That is the right province, right, Spin? Yep. Doing this for your own good, buddy. Uh, that's two of them. Now, there's some reformed ones as well. Ugh. Yeah, okay. Cleves, you're going down, Chief. And the Swiss, which I should already have claim on. All right. Might I ask you to break your alliance with Switzerland? No. Okay. Let's get the boys ready. Do I even want land from this? I don't, I don't even think I do, to be honest. Other alliance with Denmark. Key money. I want new neighbors. There you go. Castile's minus 10. Did you just establish naval dominance? <laughs> really? <laughs> what can be the most expensive guys, man? Just can't afford it. Oh, it's the cost of having to fire full level 3 advisors that's painful. Finn, I can actually convert. Alright, we're fighting one of our main allies now, unfortunately. Trust trying to save you. Oh my god, it's over here as well. And you're allied to France. To be fair, any reason to fight the French is a good reason, right? I'll piece you out. And then I'll ally you in a sec. Give me that one province. There we go. We've secured Burn. That's another one. Uh oh. Peasants War. Great Peasants War. Ugh. I'd love for you to just to join. I don't really want to have to have to kill you. Alright, let's go through Cleves. Toulouse, Munster, Holland, Berg. Alright, let's get the 22k down to deal with you and then the 30k up here. I suppose it might even be better to move my main trade capital over to the English Channel. Let's just give it a shot. Okay, so right now we make like 6.1. Yeah, that's a lot more. Lovely. Amaral of is plus 15%. Wonderful. Alright, Cleves. Let's take you out. Call in as many of the boys as we join. Straight to Toulouse itself. I mean, if Toulouse doesn't want to give me access, that's fine. Really? You'd go up to Finn? I'm trying to convert it for Catholicism. Revoke his free city status, which I have to do. It's going to hurt by five. Imperial authority, but de la vie. I don't think I needed to do that, but I've done it now. Siege of Berg. Oh, it's not fine. Moonster and, well, it's just Moonster, isn't it? Ugh, reform zealots. We got we to gotta, we gotta deal with them. I think it's a bit late, actually. <laughs> Picardy is done. Nope, Picardy is over here. We lost Picardy to lose. I thought we won. I just saw French lettering and I was like, oh, that, there we go. All right, religious center. Start doing Stuttgart. Hey, there he is. Nice. That will help convert this province. What's it? The culture. What's the culture of Stuttgart? Swabian. Can I accept Swabian? Can. Demote it later. That'll help convert it. Oh, it's getting away from me. Okay, so there's one reform down here. Uh, I've got that one. That one I can't do anything about. We're about to get this one. It's hurtful, Bohemi. Tell me I suffer from delusions of adequacy. <sighs> really getting quite unlucky with the sieges today. Or am I not? <laughs> it's confirmation bias, though, isn't it? You're, you're less likely to notice a siege that doesn't drag on. Just gonna take out these zealots. Feels like the right thing to do. Are all of you Catholic? Yeah, they. It looks like you all are, actually. Okay, if you're a Catholic, then I just need this one province. I don't need to force religion on any of you. Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Trier liberates my province and just burned it. What the hell, man? What's that about? All right, let's get all his allies out then. That's where the Dutch troops are. Or the Hollandish troops. Oh, great. Of course they did. All right, Holland will peace out. Giving me cleaves. Which gives me access to Dortmund. All right, I do burn, can I? Yeah, if I core it properly. Issue strength plus one, I'll take that. French Reconquest of Anjou. I don't really want that to happen. Nor am I really in a place to stop it. Well, I kind of want to take out Savoy. Where's the Center of Faith? Ugh. Deep in his territory. Well, that means I can't just sort of snatch and grab it. He still won't join anything. If you join here, that gives me a chance to fight the English. Oh, I thought... It'd... Okay, right. We're going to have to fight the French and the English at the same time. That's the only way it's going to work. Which means we need cogs. Let's see, how many heavies do the English have? Eight. We should be fine. Issue is he does have British ideas. That morale of armies, and navies, and heavy ship combat is pretty hefty. And the two star admiral? Yeah, I don't know if we can win that. We can try. If I land in Ireland, it'll give me a chance to hire some mercenaries as well. Okay, we got rid of one center of faith. Finn is next. No, except the culture, colonial core, religious center. Right, well, we can do that now. Oh, God, we have to be fighting Venice at the same time. Well, to be fair, technically not. I can just 
take the aggressive expansion on the chin and just take the two provinces. Oh, God, Geneva's bloody development now. I don't know if I can nab that one like I can the others. The Reformation is in full swing. Come on. Castile wouldn't come in. Hold out, Aragon. Hold out, hold out. Just hold out. Ah! Oh! Makes it 10. Come on, come on, come on. There's still a chance. I have to fight the Portuguese as well, which is going to be an issue. All right, here we go. Castile won't come in. Might as well call in the boys. Take go. All right, we are outnumbered, but that's fine. Let's go. Can't afford to lose any heavies here. Time of Leith is going down. Yeah, I'm gonna cover a little bit. Grab a flagship. This is gonna be expensive. Four maneuvers, painful. Uh, let's bow out some galleys, just to make up the numbers a little bit. Yeah, I need to take London, okay. Oh my God, okay, that's bad. Get in there so you don't get stack wiped. Ooh, maybe? No. Okay. I did not realize the English would have landed troops here. That is upsetting. We have to lock in elsewhere. And that has no leader. I don't think it has enough to cover the front line. We should be fine. He does not. Let's see if we can save the Saxons. We can. Council of Trent. Obviously, we're going to need to go as harsh as possible. Oh god, I haven't seen the Great Presence War this thing. Oh no. I've been attacked by 20 cogs. Oh, that's, that's the British Navy. That's got a sting. What does he have left? I, I don't know if we need the flagship anymore. Because flagships are extremely expensive. I'm not going to pay for it. I'm going to take another gamble. Just kill 2,000 cannons because they went in first. Love it when that happens. Okay, we have landed. <laughs> Just in the middle of a battle, guys are getting ferried across the channel. <laughs> this is how you reinforce. No, I don't know this, like, walking in via, like, men. No, you're just marching like this. Through the sea, lads. Through the sea. Caught two heavies on their own. And they're gone. Leave it alone, bud. Don't march into London. Don't march into London. Okay, we're good. Lost the Siege of Cleves. I wasn't paying attention. That's fine. Lost the Siege of Laborde. That's fine. Death stacking suit doesn't attack me again. If I take London, I should be fine. Come on. 64%. Uh, come on. 70%. Twice in a row. Can't we? Oh my god. The odds are now getting very unlikely, lads. We're being sieged down, which really sucks. Okay. That was very painful indeed. And we lost all of our ticking war score. Cool. I really needed that siege of Laborde to last a little longer. Okay, this should get Portugal out of the war. This definitely should. Portugal's gone. 43%. Let me take our... There we go. All right, wonderful. That's another one down. The Union Imperial Authority is actually going down now. Okay, so we're going against Dortmund. And then there's so many states down here that just need to be converted. Got rid of most of them, though. How many centers are left? One, two, three. Once we get rid of those three, we can just start converting everyone. And I've only not got control of one, right? That's the only one I don't control. Well... Technically, the other two now. Alavonia's formed. Nice. Goslar expanded. That's new. Uh, they are Catholic. So I'm inclined to let it go. All right. Dortmund. All right. Let's go. Fortunately, this is a good chunk of uh, Protestant land. I should now be able to force religion there. Yeah. So I can start converting people back to the true faith. And if I get rid of all the uh, centers of reformation, I should be good to go. Actually, Goslar just changed to reform, so I think you can give that land back now. All right, and that gives me a reason to fight Goslar. How many of your buddies are Catholic? All of them, apart from Lubeck. Welcome to the whack-a-mole section of the HRE, boys. <laughs> Moonster, we've danced this dance before. If you're Catholic, you get off scot-free. That's the deal you make. Minus, you know, a couple of dead troops. There you go. Mines is reformed, which means we need to force religion on him. And he's back to being Catholic. Wait, if I force religion on Dortmund, it will flip his capital, so I don't even need to convert it. That's that's the smart play here. You're Catholic, so I don't want to fight you again. I don't know what those treaties were. I just got him to get rid of, but that's fine. All right, Cologne, who are also Catholic. Nice, they'll peace out. Now there were two. Dortmund. If I force religion, it should make it disappear. Let's check. So, super peace, force religion. Yes, it does. Wonderful. Norfolk gone, so there's only one more central reformation in Europe. Okay, that's the French one. Alright, we are going to get 30k on the Venetians. There's 28k. 
It's gonna hold off the French. That doesn't seem right, does it? Do you have troops now? Yeah, you do. Okay. All right, that looked good to me. Oh, the, did the Russians come in? No, the Russians really don't want to come in ever. Um, could go very poorly indeed. Okay, let's give this a shot. All right, I'm gonna sail around into the med. I think a couple thousand more troops over here would not hurt in the slightest. Dude, he has a lot of ships as well. Yeah, he came to find me. Okay. That's terrifying. All right, retreat. I was not looking at that. That's painful. I like the idea. I like the idea. Oh, God. The Venetians, instead of defending their own line, came here. And... Oh, oh no. We're doing it again. Saxon will come in. Please do. Dude, Venice has 40,000 troops. They're, like, really big as a, as a player. That's why I need to get them out early. All right. Get in on his capital. Is that enough to get you out? No. You're going to have to actually take his capital. That's fine. You can do that. Not letting Savoy take that land. Stack weapons on Savoy. They have yet to take any forts, and the Castilians are actually pushing this time. So we there goes our navy. It's not what you want to see, is it? Take a Venezia, though. So, oh, peace out. I have no intentions of fighting Savoy after this. So, there we go. All right. Now we get another 30,000 troops in. Head to his capital, and I'm going to try blitzing it again. 434 in charge. Ah, all these ships are about to die. Ah, just take, take that province, dude. Castile, I can't tell you how important it is you take this province. Yes, okay, I saved the seven navies. <laughs> right, let's slacken, and then I'll go to free company. That's more falling on your forts. That's all slacken late. Take that. Man power recovery. The Castilian West Indies are here, boys. I don't know where those troops went. That's terrifying. All right, let's get rid of your alliance with Hungary. You know what? And give me war operations. That'll be the deal on the table for you. Oh, uh oh. I think I'll just keep the free company around, to be honest. Might as well, right? Ah, I have no sailors because they all died. So I can't actually get the free company off of this island. That's why it was important for me to get the free company there because I didn't have the sailors to build any <laughs> ships um, that would be able to land. What do you reckon? 38,000 versus the French? I'll probably do that, right? But why should we have to when we have another 25k ready to go? There we go. I want to lose back, damn it. Might as well keep fighting, you know. I've not really got anything to lose. Ah, oh, look at that. Just didn't wearables, boys. Much obliged. All right, let's bring you guys back around. Oh, you're probably going to die on the way. No, you're good. Damn, I need a lot of uh, sailors that I do not possess. Ugh. It's another grizz 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 from the first video, boys. I think religious ideas was 100% the shout. All right, now I just need to get claims on all of these idiots. Well, it's good to have long tendrils. Okay, Lubeck. I need to demand territory from. I need to do it again. I'll give you a reason to declare war on you. Is that peace internally? Looks like it. Yeah, nice. Just need to get rid of these heretic princes. And also Galicia Valenia holds territory that we need to take back. Their luck is done. Hi, right, France. I'm here to kill you. I do not like the fact that that has slipped, eh? All right. Privilege with you. With you. With you. So the French will release Toulouse. Alençon. Can I do someone better than him? Nope. I don't really need the money. Berry's more fun. Do Berry. And then there was one. Trier has occupied the province, so I can't get it. Are you kidding me? Are you are you kidding me? Trier, why? What is wrong with you? You can't core it. Oh my god, I can't believe this. Can't be selected because Trier doesn't want it. Why does he give it to me then? Oh my god, this game. Why? That makes no sense. If he doesn't want it, why are you like why are you? <laughs> He's there. He'll never peace out. Oh, you're the worst. Oh man. That's just giving me a headache. I can't do anything. I'll have to come back in five years. Oh, for God's sake. I was this close to just all of them. That's going to continue to convert stuff probably faster than I can get rid of it. Oh, my God, Tria. You're the absolute worst. I hate you. When's this truce? 57. Seven years. Are we ready for that? Right, for now, let's go after this lot. Gozla. I'll call in Tria. In fact, I can't because he'll just take the stuff. Alternatively, Lubeck. Alternatively, everyone at once. I think that's a better idea. Okay, so we're going to declare war on Gozla, and we're going to co-belligerent Lubeck, and that's going to bring in a lot of people. So we should be fighting basically Northern Europe. Okay, go one at a time. I'll call him Bohemia. Actually, so, like, I'm, I'm absolutely fuming. <laughs> All right, it's that time. If you're Catholic, you can get off scot-free. Probably minus a few alliances here and there, but that's fine. Oh, double stack wipes? Oh, yeah. Okay, let's start advancing on Hess. Are you Catholic? You are not. That's good. Means I get to take his stuff. I was betting that we'd win Berlin before he'd win that, because you know it was on minus 35% and we were on 7% with breach walls, but that's how this game goes. Can you tell that I'm just getting progressively more annoyed now? <laughs> that really set me off. Wait, Trier is Oh well well. Would you look who 
is now reform. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hurt you. <laughs> Same thing, you are Catholic, so we just need to get rid of your alliances, just in case. All right, that should be you done. Force religion, my Ansbach and Rothenburg, I'll split my troops, one can go on either. Expand the empire against the papal state. Oh, Sienna joined. So did Genoa, nice. I've got this free company ready to, to head over here. I'm gonna get rid of him. No, I don't do anything. I have to say, putting him in these forts was probably the best idea I ever, I ever made. Best idea I ever made. Come on, mate. Best idea I ever had. Best decision I ever made. What is wrong with Oh, Ansbach. Arken, sorry. Oh my god, my brain is exp It's just melting. Ansbach. Uh, Arken! Arken is good. That's good that Arken is in this war because they are reformed and a free city, and I don't want to lose the whole um, imperial authority to revoke their status. All right, Ansbach. Do this. Super peace. Hungary. Force religion. War reps. Okay, I didn't get Beirut. Okay, so it's just three left. So East Frisia, Lubeck, Arken, and Goslar. I'll grab the front of the faith, makes sense. I'm gonna get Deus Vault, finish it off. Really? It's bold, I'll give you that. It is a bold attempt to try and land troops in England, but yeah, no. Look at that, one, one little province is still converting, still going. Damn, everyone pulled in on you. With any luck, it'll go to someone that I can actually declare war on. Lubeck, release two nations, force religion. Authority is still declining because we've got 26 heretic princes. Ugh! <gasps> Let's die. Arkan, you have so many allies. It's ridiculous. East Frisia. That's Hamburg as well. I was improving relations with Switzerland. I was spying on him. And Hamburg. Tempted to take Hamburg because there's a lot of guys around here. Yeah, I'm going to take Hamburg because that's a lot of Protestants and, and reformed and, and such. Give Leipzig back to Saxony. Force religion. I'm sorry to do this to you, Gosler. There we go. Okay, and uh, now it's time to murder you. Okay, who was it that, that was it you? I could have sworn someone. I had a claim against someone for Imperial ban. Expand Empire against Berry, Saxa, Savoy. The conquest against Moldavia. Friesland, cross the peasantry. Okay, well, let's do that one. Friesland. Oldenburg's gonna get involved. Who's Oldenburg allied to? Nassau and Gelra. Is Nassau? Nassau's reformed, so I want that to happen. Wurzburg and Berg. Berg is reformed. Sounds good. Wurzburg. Well, Friesland. Friesland's not reformed. Berg is. I'm going through here because they're more likely to ally guys who are their faith. Uh, Wurzburg isn't. Berg is. Do nicely. Anna Castile will come in. Why not? Try to do that. Friesland? <laughs> is it colonizing? Okay, right, Cologne. Oh, right, I wanted to murder this guy. Water friction is good enough for me. I did just assume that Spain would do the work for me, but uh, there's some folly in that. Namely, that Spain doesn't do anything to help me, ever. Having said that, they did more than I did there. Damn, these are some good generals. All right, I must have with Nassau. Yeah, Gilra. Oldenburg's done. So done. Wurzburg. About to get this vault. Mystery strength versus heretics plus 3%. Yes, please. Speaking of heretics, let's go deal with them. Constance. You do look pretty, uh, you know, reformed, which is good. So I can convert you as well. Okay. Lending of heresy. Just need that province there. Faith Bastion. We'll take that. And we get another government reform. Government reputation. It's in character. Let's get some of these guys out. All right. Let's get rid of all your alliances. Force religion. Give me money. Well, there isn't even going to be a religious war at this point. Got to be careful here. Tria is dead. Alone. I can improve relations with you. Force religion. This is a different war. Okay. Sex Lamberg. There we go. Starting to get the swing of things now. All right. Berg. Force religion on you. I'll do me. Oh, Gelra. And, and do Gelra. Uh, similar thing, lads. Get rid of all your alliances. Wurzburg, I think that's it for this lot. Double check. Yep. Okay. So you, force religion, force government, wonderful. Now it's just Switzerland. So Regensburg, wherever that is. You are, oh, you are, oh, wonderful. A free city as well. Two for one. Apparently I had imperial ban on someone. Yeah, two provinces. Okay. Who has those, what, what has gone on here? Okay, that was weird. Uh, who has those provinces? find out. Venice. I like the French. They're a lot less scary now. I do want to take out the Venetians. What they did to my navy. My beautiful, beautiful navy. Speaking of, I should probably build it back up. I had 14. He killed seven heavies. And all of my galleys as well. Okay, so... We can also reset the troops down in France. Release some more of their troops. Troops? Uh, nations. 
within them that they stole from themselves. It's fine. Look, they say the victors write history, and so I'm gonna make sure I write it such that I don't look like an idiot. Let's double check, make sure I'm actually winning all of these. Yeah, unfortunately. All right, Trier. I was meant to do Trier before anything else, wasn't I? Die. I want to take Trier as a vassal because I can then, pretty sure I can use up the electorate. I lose in five imperial authority, but I become an elector. I think it's worth it. How much do I get in war operations? <laughs> Yeah, like 10 ducats a month. All right. Switzerland. Need that province chief and force religion. Okay, let's go ahead and convert the final center of faith before anything else. Oh, Frankfurt is a free city and also reform. That's good for us. Meantime, we'll enlist the help of the Castilians to fight against the Frankels and bring them into the empire. I don't need to enlist their help. I'm just going to. And also, Savoy's dead. There is no more Savoy. Oh, I lost a seat. <laughs> One last thing from Trier, huh? You bastard. I'm going to lose this next election if I'm not careful. Oh god, reform zealots. Not today, bud. Hey, we did it. All the centers of reformation are gone. And most people are now hours off. I... Why? And shit, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't don't make me lose crack off for the first time. Two last stings, eh? <laughs> Trier. I legitimately hate this nation. I wasn't even Trier. Blaming them anyway. I just like that like every few years in Europe, everyone has to switch around their alliances because I go in and just get rid of them all. Come my vassal. We go. Now, go. This is up the electorate. And I'm an elector. Obviously, I'm going to vote for myself. So land should just, just peace out, chief, yeah? I would. Um, okay. Why can't I get you to release um, Savoy? I gain nine imperial authority. I can start doing that now. Because my... Here's the thing. I didn't want to go around rampaging and expanding the empire and getting all this imperial authority if I couldn't use it because it would be declining. But we have enough now. Uh, 13 princes in the empire. Who else is there? You. Allied to Augsburg. Augsburg is in a trade league with Genoa. And it's Aragon. It's like a puzzle trying to figure out how to touch you guys. Uh, that sounds bad. Um, over here, I can get to Lundberg and I can get to East Frisia. Right, what else can I expand empire on? Oh, right. I wanted to fight Venice and the French by extension. Yeah, we got the vote secured. Just Cologne, really. I don't like me because of aggressive expansion and I force you to return land. Well, that's okay. Come on. Don't be mad about it. Should be okay. And just bypass the forts because of course he does. He's right. All right. Let's help the Castilians. They've actually turned up this time. Smash the French. So they're doing as I asked and taking that province. It's good. Then I can rest my fleet there. I'm going to start a gold era. Why not? Okay. So that's a stack wipe. Just had how many thousand troops die? Okay. Let's, uh... Start conform. Okay, we need to start doing 30k stacks. That's a lot of troops just died. We'll do 30 and 6. I do not like how close the, the Bohemians are to nicking this from me. Imagine that I do all the work and then just get voted out. I think I just, I mean, at that point, I don't know. It's all over for me, isn't it? Oh my god, he caught half my army. He's going to stack wipe it again. I don't know. There's only a thousand of my men. The Palatinate troops he's got. The Allied Avignon. Nice. Get rid of your alliance with Venice. I don't really want to humiliate. Uh, Champagne would be a good one. Yeah, we need the 100% ideally, don't we? Every own province in Europe following the Protestant Anglican faith. Okay, well, it's fine. It's, it's not ours. Not that many of them in our uh, territory. French are going to come stack wiping. Watch. Lost the siege of Chartres. I'm going to take Venice. I'm going to finish there. I'm going to take Chartres. Ooh, where's he going? It's stack wiping. There we go. We won a Venezia immediately. We have like 36,000 men. I should probably be using. Brunswick. Come on, buddy. Give it up. Herding cats. Took my ships, you bastard. Yeah, I'm not gonna do this again though. In fact, it's probably deep. get up, get up, go, 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 go. Flee, flee back to the channel. Europe, like I've never seen border go this bad in Europe. It's horrible. That's on me. I wanted to claim on someone over here, didn't I? Tree is already done. She's freezy, yeah. And one over here. French had so much potential in this game until I came in. Uh, yeah, champagne works. And then they annul their alliance with Venice, and then they'll give us lots of money. Why do I have a free merchant? Take it. Give that stuff back to Milan. That'll do. There we go. Lots of independent states now. Scornfully insult taboos and scornfully insult Berry. Because you know what we're about to do. It's time we expanded the empire a little bit. Where are the rest of my troops? Okay, they're over here. Uh, I need to go to Champagne and I need you to go to Milan. It's a bit ungrateful for Milan, isn't it? Considering I just, you know, gave them their land back. What am I really going to walk through this for? Oh, yeah, because. That makes sense. <laughs> I'm exiled. Rothenburg is converted back. Why are you like this? All right, Paderborn. Run a lawful territory. Ravensburg, you say no, and I'll liberate it. Can I expand empire with Toulouse? No. Which sucks, because they're not the target, which is really stupid. 
Got a white piece with to lose. Long. Release a couple different nations. Berg, can you release anyone? No. Why are you here then, bud? An empire. Gives me one imperial authority. Hooray. <laughs> we did it. We won. I swear to god, these guys are going up. Tons of the amount of heretics around. I can defend France against Avignon. <laughs> against um uh, Dauphiné. I think at some point you do get a Cassus Belli. It gives you Cassus Belli on every single heretic prince. Span Empire. Two years, and then I can go in against Lundberg. Why are you fight? What? British Conquest of Orkney. Okay. Meanwhile, Russia's doing having a great time because I've not <laughs> countered them in the slightest. There's a timeline where I got that personal union, and things are a bit better. Right? Did you add everything? He added everything to the empire, right? So if I release these two nations, it should make them princes. All right, super peace. Yeah, that's what I want. Hungary, sure. They should be princes. Yep, they are. Wonderful. Does that work for you as well? No, because he's not really in the HRE. Well done, though. Smart chap you are. Excellent. We've got the 51 required. But it's because I'm not Germanic. So maybe if I were Germanic. Yeah, I don't think I can do that without hideous upheaval. I'm sure I can't expand it. Empire. Maybe it's is it only Catholics I can no sense. Why I don't what determines whether I can expand empire or not? Teen heretic princes. Let's get rid of them. Uh they're all over here though. I don't have a reason to declare war on them. Cologne I do, which would bring in one of them. I get a diplomatic reputation guy, that should up it a little bit, right? Oh yeah. They like that now. Otherwise I can expand empire on I have already done that. Go on air and everyone's voting for me. Wonderful. Why would I vote for Bohemia? Ooh, I can get two guys right here. Three heretics. <gasps> Four heretics in one? No. The dream? All right, Lundberg, cleansing of heresy, call in his buddy. Bohemia wouldn't come in, that's perfect. Holstein of Strasbourg, do you have any allies that are? No, unless you are, nope. Strasbourg, Strasbourg's down here, isn't he? Yeah, Constans, no. Paderborn? So, yeah, definitely worth it. But, you know, I kind of want to go against Paderborn myself, and I can release two. Ah, whatever, let's do it. So, we need to declare war on you, we call in Anhalt, and then we call in Strasbourg, which means that the Palatinate, I don't want to fight the Palatinate. Yeah, we'll do Paderborn later. Alright, dear group. Literally anything will give me different reputation at this point. Influence ideas will. Do that. The whole scene's done. Anhalt's done. Strasbourg's about to be done. Oh, God, I'm done out. Super peace. Force religion. And get rid of your alliances. One down. Two down. Three down and four down. No point getting resistance to Reformation. The Reformation's already gone. It's starting to tick up more and more now. 31 4, 41 against. Close. We just need a bit more Imperial Authority. If I was Germanic, they'd have done it a while ago. Maybe it is worth switching to Germanic. Cost me a lot of admin. So, for those of you who don't know, what I can do is like unstate all of my territory, then switch to Germanic, and then, well, the culture shift to will like Flemish, and then uh, go from there. I don't really want to. So it's a bit of a pain. But I could save like five each time. Oh, they're close. 35 4, 37 against. Bit more Imperial Authority and we'll get it. There we go. Perpetual Diet. So Imperial Authority from free cities plus 50%. And a permanent location will be established for the Diet to convene in. For a safe and secure society. Nice. It's going to be in Milan. Nice. Okay, cool. And that also helps our Imperial Authority gain. Excellent. Right, well, there we go, lads. That is all for today. We've, we've cleared the hurdle. Um, and now it's just a case of getting these guys in the empire. So what I do now is I go over here and I declare for expand the empire. Uh, and then when I do expand the empire, it's going to give me, you know, a little bit each time. 6.8, for example. I attack the French, get them to release more nations, attack the uh, uh, Hungarians, potentially the Ottomans as well. Get everyone to release more and more nations each time. Again, like we can probably dominate the Ottomans at this point. Uh, and each time I get them into the empire, all these Italian states as well, I should get between 1 and 10, depending on how big they are. Someone like Provence gave me 7, um, to give some context. Um, so I'll probably get like 3 or 4 each time, but like 5 of those, and I'm halfway there. Plus, in the meantime, we'll be taking out these heretic princes, which when we've got peace will give us another 0.25 a month. And then after this um, point here, where we disallow HRE internal wars, is just, yeah, it's game over. So, that is what we look like. In fact, I want to make a save, and I'm going to... I want to see this. If I go in the religious map mode... Oh, I can't do the religious map mode uh, timeouts. Oh, well. 
So yes, lads, if you want to see more of Krakow, you know what you need to do? You need to like the video, subscribe, all that good stuff. Right, leave a comment for the algorithm because um, I only do these things when people are interested. So if you're interested to see what a centralized or decentralized HRE looks like, let me know. And if you want me to do decentralized or centralized, also let me know. I'm tempted to go decentralized because the standard thing is to centralize. But having said that, the clickbait title of I formed the HRE for a one promise minor, pretty, pretty good. So lads, if that's of interest, make sure to like and subscribe, like I said, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye. Huge shout out to our patrons, most notably, Charlie Demorel, Krilly, Flyerton, JDow52, Cargon, Xiaomi, Lewis Wright, Nicole's Christ, QA Shard, Redguard, and Shadow Singer. Your support means a lot, guys. Whilst you're here, you might as well click on another video. I mean, it's, it's literally right there.